hello today we will discuss the interfacing of uh, keyboard and a display with 8086 microprocessor why using 8279 as an interfacing device 8279 is also called as display controller so we will discuss all this section one by one before moving towards the keyboard section and, and the display section let us first of all discuss the other ICs that are using uh, in this interfacing in these connections irrespective of the 8279 that is an interfacing device uh, and 8086 IC that is a processor uh, we are also using 8259 which is an interrupt controller uh, and 8288 which is an address ledge and the third one is 8284 which is called as clock generator so these three all ICs are also used um, irrespective of other uh, ICs now we will discuss the connections of keyboard with the 8279 here we are using a keyboard which is called as 8 is to 8 matrix keyboard as we have discussed in, in our previous video lecture that uh, for connecting 8 is to 8 matrix keyboard with the 8259 we require uh, we require actually a decoder for decoding the uh, scan lines that are generated by the scan counter so to decode the uh, binary digits that are coming from the scan line here we are using 3 is to 8 decoder actually decoder is a uh, what this decoder is actually how it is behaving is that 3 input, input lines are coming 3 input lines are coming and 8 output lines are outgoing so it is known as 3 is to 8 decoder actually we require 8 output lines uh, that is going to be interface with the 8 rows and 8 columns of then of a keyboard so 3 is to 8 decoder is used uh, now from this uh, keyboard section there are um, uh, connections of 8279 with the keyboard through the returns line these are RL not to RL7 8 returns lines are coming from keyboard section towards the 8279 uh, other than this the shift uh, shift and control signals are also um, um, coming towards the are connecting with the 8279 processor now moving towards the display section here we can see that a display is used uh, with the display we can see that from these uh, four scanning line we are actually uh, demultiplexing these four scanning lines these four scanning line into 16 lines actually here we are using a demultiplexer which is known as demux which actually converts these four lines into 16 outgoing line this is called as 4 is to 16 demux so here we are using a 4 is to 16 demux which actually convert the four six uh, four uh, scanning line uh, into 16 different line which is going to be connected with the 8 or uh, 8 or 16 character display section with the display section there is also a connection of 4 4 bit 4 bit data lines these can be either individually used or we can use them as a 8 bit uh, data line um, as a, when we combine them now moving toward the 8086 processor here we can see that 8086 processor is linked with the uh, 8279 interfacing device through this interrupt pin actually this is the 
IRQ pin of 8279 this is to be connected with uh, 8086 through the 8259 interrupt controller actually this interrupt controller uh, we are using because uh, when there are number of interrupts are interrupting at a particular instant so 8086 processor cannot handle all these uh, interrupting uh, signals so to prioritize those interrupts uh, which will be handled first and which will be uh, handled last that prioritizing will be done by 8259 interrupt controller now the next section is the 8282 address ledge as we have discussed in previous lecture that 8282 address ledge actually bifurcate actually uh, demultiplex the address data bus this is the address data bus demultiplex into address bus and data bus so actually it bifurcates the combined address data bus into uh, address bus and data bus which can be used individually now the uh, next section uh, we are using is the uh, here the read write pin of the 8086 microprocessor is to be connected with the uh, input output read write of the 8279 which is going to be controlled by the CS pin and A0 pin which this CS pin actually uh, uh, when this CS pin is low then uh, read write operation will be performed when CS pin is 1 no read write operation can be pro, uh, performed that is read write operation will be blocked at that time uh, at that time other control signals and command signals are going to be operated so next we have 8282 clock generator this 8282 clock generator actually provides the clock to the uh, microprocessor and also to the 8279 uh, through this clock pin and uh, this will actually uh, synchronize both the uh, synchronize both the device functioning so that it can, they can function uh, in synchronize now we have left with uh, a signal cause address decoder actually this is a address decoder mm, this decoder is actually used to decode the address which is coming from the 8086 microprocessor that we have to what data we have to display at the display device so this is all about the interfacing of uh, keyboard and a display with the 8086 processor by using 8279 as an interfacing device irrespective of the other ICs that is 8259, 8282 and 8284 thank you